Okay, this is factoring a hard trinomial using the triple play method. Now, first of all, I understand it's a hard trinomial because I see a number here, but that number doesn't go into 16 and it doesn't go into 5. So, just like the decomposition, I start my question off by doing 3 times 5. Well, that gives me 15. My first term, 3 times my second term. Now, I'm going to work with the 15. What multiplies to make 15 and adds up to 16? Well, here are the numbers that multiply to make 15. And you can see that they are the, that's the only combination that adds up to 16. Now, with triple play, you take your first term, 3x squared, and you write it down three times. Here and here, you don't put the x squared. And here you don't even put the uh, any ats. That, but you do write the three down three times, and that's the three from there, and that's where the word triple play gets its name. Now you take the one and the fifteen. You know both signs are going to be the same, and they're both going to be a plus. So you write here plus one and plus fifteen. So the plus one comes there, and the plus fifteen comes there and put this in brackets, and this in brackets, and a big divide sign. Now what you say to yourself is, self, does 3 go into both of those? And the answer is no. Does 3 go into both of those? And the answer is yes. So let's divide 3 into both of those, and this bracket comes down, 3 into 3x three is x, and 3 into 15 is 5. So there is one bracket for my answer. Then I just drop this bracket down, and there is the other bracket of my answer. And I have now factored the hard trinomial that way. So with triple play, you start by writing the 3x squared as 3x, 3x, and 3. You take the numbers that add up to 16, plus 1 and plus 15, and you look for a common factor. Now there is one thing that you have to watch for on triple play and I'll show you that in the next uh, video that's coming up. But there is quite a quick and easy way to factor a hard trinomial.